The Iron Dome aerial defense system just intercepted a Hamas unmanned aerial vehicle that crossed from Gaza into Israel, Israeli defense forces said on Thursday that in the last three days, Hamas has fired more than 1,500 rockets from Gaza all the way into Israel. The night sky over Israel has been ablaze with interceptor missiles from Iron Dome shooting down the incoming rockets in the sky. Now the question arises, what is Iron Dome? Iron Dome is a multi-mission system capable of intercepting rockets, artillery, mortars and precision-guided munitions like very short-range air defense systems as well as aircraft, helicopters and unmanned aerial vehicles over short ranges of up to 70 kilometers. It is an all-weather system and can engage multiple targets simultaneously and can be deployed over land and sea. Iron Dome is jointly manufactured by Rafael Advanced Systems and has been in service with Israeli Air Force since 2011. The radar system was developed by ELTA. Its development was prompted after a series of rocket attacks on Israel by Hezbollah and Hamas in the 2000s. In the 2006 Lebanon War, around 4,000 rockets were fired on the northern parts of Israel resulting in the death of about 44 Israeli civilians and the evacuation of around 250,000 citizens. How does it work? An Iron Dome battery consists of a battle management control unit, a detection and tracking radar and a firing unit of three vertical launchers, with 20 interceptor missiles each. The interceptor missile uses a proximity fuse to detonate the target warhead in the air. The Iron Dome is deployed in a layered defense along with David's sling and aero missile defense system which are designed for medium and long-range threats. One of the system's important advantages is its ability to identify the anticipated point of impact of the threatening rocket, to calculate whether it will fall in a built-up area or not, and to decide on this basis whether or not to engage it. This prevents unnecessary interception of rockets that will fall in open areas and thus not cause damage, the paper states. The system has intercepted thousands of rockets so far, and, according to Rafael Advanced Systems, its success rate is over 90%. The iDome is the mobile variant with all components on a single truck. The Iron Dome was expensive to develop, but manufacturers say it is cost-effective because of technology it uses to differentiate between missiles likely to hit built-up areas and those that won't. Static and mobile units only launch interceptor missiles to shoot down anything interpreted as dangerous. A decade since the Iron Dome became operational, Israel now has 10 batteries deployed across the country, each with three to four launchers that can fire 20 interceptor missiles. The number of Israelis killed and wounded would be far higher if it had not been for the Iron Dome system which has been a lifesaver as it always is, Israeli military spokesman Lt. Col. Jonathan Konrikas said this week. But some analysts say the intensity of recent barrages from Gaza suggests militant groups are attempting to overwhelm the Iron Dome, raising concerns about the system's possible limitations. That's all for now, if you like this video, subscribe to my channel, and till then keep watching.